It's Donovan Everett from Cape Racing and uh, I'd just like to say it's an absolute pleasure to be involved with uh, Intrabet and Cape Breeders in this, uh, in this golf day today here at Pool Valley. Um, it's fantastic for the industry to see all the relevant stakeholders coming down and having a good time and networking and it's exactly what the, the industry needs right now in terms of moving forward and recreating some positivity to take us forward into the next year. We're on to race number six on the program, 1400 meters the trip. This is an MR66 handicap, 25 past three is uh, the off time. And uh, having a look at this uh, race, Buster Keaton tops the boards here, 18 to 10, five to two all the time, four to one Brave Voyager, five to one Drogarati, it's then 10 to one and better bar those. Now, Winter Waves is scratched and it's a field of six run, field of eight runners rather that line up for this contest. I think this is a two horse race between Buster Keaton and uh, all the time. It's, those are the only two horses that I've gone in my place accumulator. Richard Free rides for Andre Nell. This horse, Buster Keaton, ran a very good third last amount behind Winter Waves. He now goes up to 1400 meters, a trip that uh, he ran a very good second in, in his penultimate start and I think he'll go well. And then number six all the time, who's been a bit unlucky in a couple of his starts. Rachel Venica gets on well with him, two rides, one win, one second, win over track and trip, a runner that's in good form for a yard that do have their horses in a good space. So I think five and six will fight it out in the sixth race on the program. If you're looking past those, those two horses, well then I think it becomes a field race. Let's not uh, go on and on about the sixth race because I agree 100% with you. The winner will come from five Buster Keaton or six all the time. But I would just like to add one more contribution for trifectas and quartets, some horses that you've got to, you know, you've got to respect. Um, and you're going to say, well, it's just about the rest of the field. But be that as it may, you know, you, you might want to go Buster Keaton all the time for first and, and second by these three horses. Because I think one few dollars more could do a little better. Uh, first time out the maidens, he lost the rider uh, last time. So I think he can improve some more out the maidens, few dollars more. Uh, Drogarati never too far off the action, could be a bit of a lurker here. Brave Voyager is always there and thereabouts. And then this horse number nine, Stevie G, who's my value choice in the race. Um, I, I wouldn't be surprised if he ran a very good race, number nine, Stevie G. But those horses, one, two, four, nine, are just for the trifectas and quartets. As for the win position, we're not going to argue much. We're not going to go on and on. Uh, five Buster Keaton, six all the time for the win position. That's me. Yeah, I think uh, straight two or straight the race where you can go lights in the pick six and jackpots five and six. I think those two numbers should be good enough to see you through all of the exotics on the day. I bet with Interbet only. They're a fantastic site. I've never had any issues with them. They are very professional. There's never a problem. You deposit money, two seconds later it's in your account. You withdraw, which I do very occasionally, and uh, I believe it's also two seconds it's in your account. <laughs> <laughs>